is stupid. So check this out. About a week ago, a guy was running from the police on foot. And while running from the police, a guy pulled out a blade and severed his penis and threw it at the police. <laughs> yeah. And first of all, it's like, yeah, kind of messed up. It's like nobody deserves to have a dick thrown at you. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Nobody deserves it. I don't care what you did. You know? And I thought it was pretty messed up. And that's like dangerous. Like imagine having been a black dick. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Gotta be messed up. And also as well too, by the way, the officers, two of the officers actually got terminated, right? For playing with the evidence, toying with the evidence <laughs> at the precinct. Uh, I can't make this shit up. You just picture the officers in there like just playing hot potato with the dead dick. No. You know what I'm saying? Also as well too, by the way, I do want to shout out my son who's graduating high school this year. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Number one resource student in Nashville, Tennessee. Ain't that something? Yeah. Yeah. Smartest, dumbest kid in Nashville, Tennessee. <laughs> I can't wait to see him graduate. That way I can wipe the tears across my face while you wipe the drool across his lip. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm so excited for it. Now, I also have a son, a seven year old that's in Nashville, Tennessee. That's my baby boy, Kyra. Now, the way me and him keep in touch, we do it through like our Oculus. You know, the headset, you know what I'm talking about in VR? Yeah, you can actually do that. You can play games online now, you know, chat back and forth, totally different state. It's totally different how it was back in my days. I'm an 80s man. You know what I started out with? The Atari 3000. You guys remember that? Pac-Man, bro. Now listen, I know some folks are looking confused. Got people a little young, let me explain. So those are not familiar with Pac-Man, right? So try to vision this crackhead who's just addicted to pills and shit. He just keeps eating these pills and he eats so many pills he starts hallucinating and seeing ghosts. You know what I'm saying? And before you know it, now he's trying to eat the damn ghosts. That was Pac-Man. But after Pac-Man, I then graduated to Super Mario, which is, and, 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 yeah, Super Mario, that's Nintendo, right? Okay. Nintendo, Super Nintendo. And that's where things start to get a little racist. And if you're not familiar with Super Mario, try to picture like two illegal immigrants, right? Who's addicted to eating mushrooms, right? High from mushrooms, living in the sewers, driving go-karts and shit, had this crazy infatuation with this white bitch named Princess. <laughs> that's okay, that's okay. Because after Super Mario, it translated to, they came out the Super Nintendo, and then it went to Donkey Kong. That's where it really got racist. You got the monkey with the, the big eyes, the big lips, all right? Bananas, you might as well call them nigga Kong. You know what I'm saying? You might as well. Also as well too, but after that, excuse me, after that, then we went to the Genesis. Remember that? You had Street Fighter, you got Mortal Kombat, all right? That's when shit got real. That's when you were able to start killing people. And this shit was ridiculous. Like you literally take your fingers, like two fingers, and stick it right up the ass and grab their heart and shit and just pull that shit out and bite it. And then you have superpowers. Superpowers are unreal. You can shoot fire out your ass, ice out your dick. And shit was freaking amazing. I cannot make it up. But then they had the one black guy. Oh, uh, you guys know what that was? Mortal Kombat? That was Jax. Jax. Jax had middle arms, y'all. Whack ass superpower. No, 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 no black guy want that shit. You know what I'm saying? That's whack. That's whack. They're going to give me a real superpower. They give me the ability to change clothes. That way, if I get chased by police, I got to cut my dick off. I just turn white. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Beautiful. I also would like to announce as well, too, by the way. Man, I'm officially a uh, one year uh, recovering porn holiday. If you want to, you don't even got to clap. Just take your hands and just jack it. <laughs> I'm done. That's it. I haven't touched it one year. I haven't even watched it. One year. Stay clean away from it. Let me tell you how I know I was starting to get like a, a, addicted to that porn. It's like a really good, right? I started like with like searching up shit that wasn't even like normal. I started searching up pregnant midgets, which is crazy because I didn't even know midgets could get pregnant. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? 
Right? Yeah. That's, like, that's like a baby having a baby. You know what I'm saying? And then I was like, you know what? I need to spice it up, because now that's starting to get boring. So then I searched up pregnant midget oranges. Man, listen. Pregnant midget oranges. Oh, boy. You got this big pool of just bubbling water. What do you call the, the what is it, the, the jacuzzi? The hot tub, man, the bubbling water. 100 midgets, just fucking little pieces of fat, white, like so I was boiling a bit, a pot of chicken nuggets. It was unbelievable. Listen, my name is Deshaun, the comedian. That's my time. You guys have been great. Yeah.